This presentation is about Georgian rings and Georgian style jewelry and it is brought to you by www.qualityvintageengagementrings.com Now as you are purchasing a vintage or an antique engagement ring you'll find that these rings and pieces of jewelry date back to specific time periods. Um, there were six decorative periods that occurred between the 1700s and the 1940s and each of these time periods has a very individual unique style. They're all very different from each other. Um, today we're just going to focus on the Georgian style and that is actually the oldest style um, in this time frame that we're looking at. It ran from about 1714 to about 1830 um, and the years the specific years are debatable. Uh, it's hard to say exactly when a specific time period started and when it ended, but this is just kind of the general time frame, you know, the 1700s and the early 1800s. Now, um, like I said, the Georgian rings, the Georgian jewelry, is the oldest that can be found. Um, it's very, very hard to find because it is dated so long ago. Um, we don't really have any jewelry pieces that date back before the 1700s and so these are pretty much the oldest jewelry pieces that you can purchase today. Um, the reason they're very difficult to find is because at the time the people considered the individual pieces of the ring to be more valuable than the ring as a whole. And so for example if they had a, a diamond ring they at times would melt it down, melt down the metals, and use the metal and the diamond for something else. Um, the metal itself and the diamond itself was more valuable than the ring as a whole. Now silver, silver was very popular. Um, the designers believed that the silver helped to bring out the brilliance of the diamonds and you know the white color of the metal made the diamond shine more and so most of the rings and the jewelry pieces from the Georgian time period were silver and diamonds were usually the main stone. Um, you may be able to find some other semi-precious stones, but for the most part, diamonds are what was used for the jewelry during that time. Now, one of the most popular designs is known as the crowned heart. And this design was a very strong, deep symbol of love in the, Jordan, in the Georgian um, time period. And so, you know, lovers would have these rings designed with the crowned heart and present them to their bride-to-be or, you know, whoever it was that they wanted to, to profess their love to, really. And it was just a very, very strong symbol was that crowned heart. And, you know, that has carried into some of the modern rings today. Sometimes brides do choose to have that crowned heart design placed in their modern ring just because of the story that it tells and the history that it shares of the deep profound love that people would share with that design. Um, one very unique thing about the Georgian style jewelry is some of the jewelry was made to be adjustable and so like a necklace could be turned into two bracelets or some of the pieces of the bracelets could be taken off to be earrings um, or brooches or different things like that. People didn't have a lot of variety of jewelry themselves. Most people only owned just a few jewelry pieces and so they liked that adjustable factor because then they could use it to create other things as well. And all of the pieces were handmade um, back in the 1700s and the early 1800s. They didn't have the technology that we have today, you know, to make the rings. And so all of them are handmade. Um, if you do find any Georgian rings or, you know, these true antique pieces, they are very, very valuable because of the history that they contain and, you know, the rarity of, of the style of jewelry. So that gives you kind of a general overview about Georgian style and Georgian engagement rings. Um, we do have a lot more information on our website about, you know, the other decorative jewelry periods as well. So if you'd like more information about jewelry periods or even just general information about diamonds and engagement rings, check out our website because we've got some great resources there. Again, that website URL is www.qualityvintageengagementrings.com.